Hello there, everybody watching Pizza 100. Uh, Road popped up on my recommended, so I said, why not try and Gordon Ramsay's fish and chips? I want to see his review on this. All right, y'all. So I'm currently headed to the gas station real yeah. quick. About to grab a beverage real mm -hmm. quick. After I do that, y'all, I'm hearing that Gordon Ramsay got a new restaurant out here, bro. Really? That fish and chips show, he just put it in Washington, D.C. I'm about to dry there real quick. That's crazy. We're going to try them fish and chips, y'all. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and grab a water because these kidney stones been killing me again. Them stones just were not let up, y'all, and it's crazy to me, bro. Like, I thought that I, I defeated the stones, I urinated them out, and they was in uh, the toilet, bro, but they back up in their kidneys, fool. And I just don't know what to do, like. I've I not had to deal with kidney stones, ass. and I don't really want to. Biden. Damn. Democrats can suck my, what? Y'all, I feel like politics is one of the biggest scams ever, you feel me? I feel like at the end. I'm saying, bro, they're, uh, it's so annoying, bro, because. It's all vote this, vote that, but then they're all bashing each other. Like, bro, you guys are so busy going at each other that I don't even know what you guys are good for. Like, damn. Today, it's just put there. And then as soon as somebody gets elected, I don't like. I don't even know what they do. Like Biden, they say he did shit, but then I don't know if he did anything. Honestly, I mean, I could easily look it up if I really wanted to, but I don't feel like it. To divide and conquer the people because they already know that. If the people ain't working together, then they can continue to manipulate and control the people. You know what I'm saying? Like, this dude's out here making posters saying, fuck Democrats and fuck all this other shit. And it's like, bro, like, it's oh, dumb. Like, what is that shit really doing? Like, they can't even have a conversation. Like, bro, you guys can't talk to each other now? You know what I'm saying? Like, the poster's not really doing anything. It's right? How is, how is that helping us as a society grow? It's not really helping anything, honestly, bro. It's just, you're just doing it to do it. Like, you just, you're wasting energy on shit that don't matter. Like, I say don't matter, not like voting doesn't matter, but the poster you're making saying shit like that don't matter. Alright y'all, so I'm down here at the wharf, not gonna lie to y'all, y'all gonna have to pay for parking if y'all decide to come out here. So make sure really? you bring some loot, or your ass gonna get told if you park on the side of the street. Letting you know right here, right now, bro, so you don't do nothing dumb. What it do? Y'all, look at this view. Gordon knew exactly what he was doing. Yeah. Gordon was like, if I'm gonna give him fish and chips, I'm gonna let him eat fish and chips on the water. He said that shit coming fresh. He to jump right on the water, bro. You know what I'm saying? And that's the reason why he's one of the best chefs in the world. You know what I'm saying? Look, he knew exactly what to do. They even got a statue of Gordon Ramsay out this bitch. Really? That's you know not him. Peeling a, peeling a Is lobster. it him? I don't think that's him. That's Damn. not him. Gordon's a goat. It's, bro, like, this shit I don't is think that's him. good for like a date night. Like, look at this, bro. You know what I'm saying? You bring your broad out here, bro. You getting in them drawers. I'm not going to lie to you, bro. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. You getting you some pussy, bro. But like, if you bring a broad out here, bro, it's happening. It's going down. All right, y'all. So you see where I'm at now. I'm at the Gordon Ramsay fish and the chips. You know what I'm saying? You see all them Britain flags and all that, bro. We here, bro. We at Gordon Ramsay's place of business. Let's see what's good with it. And on this side, we got the Hell's Kitchen. We've got to come back for that one. We going to try all Gordon's Hell's Kitchen, y'all. Alright y'all, so I paid $51 for two Damn. meals. Also got oh. a sticky toffee milkshake. You see how it's looking. This young guy. Ain't gonna lie to y'all. That toffee looking extra sticky. Look at that shit. Sheesh. So I ain't gonna lie to y'all, bro. This is fast food, you feel me? We ordered the junk, the junk ready. It's like McDonald's. You know what I'm saying? Shit already sitting in the back. We in there. Let's see what's up with the Gordon Ramsay fish and chips. Alright y'all, so we gonna start out with the sticky toffee uh, milkshake. You know what I'm saying? You see that shit is extra sticky all around the edges. You know what I'm saying? They put that drizzle up on there. I'm not a big coffee guy though, so. Be 100% honest with y'all. You taste no toffee, all you taste is vanilla ice cream. You feel me? So Gordon Ramsay, I'm kind of disappointed off the rip because you're saying that it's a sticky toffee. You got a little bit of sticky toffee around the edges, but it's not in the shape, you know what I'm saying? All I taste is vanilla ice cream. This is an easy 3 out of 10, y'all. It's not what they say it is, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's a vanilla shape. 
Now we got the food. Hey, yo, who pissed now off the lie, Thunder bro. Guards? Because that nigga rumbling Ooh, outside my crazy, door. Bro, it smells incredible. Not going out of y'all. That nigga mad at somebody. Hopefully, it's not me. Here we go, y'all. So I ain't going to lie to y'all, the presentation's looking crazy. He got yeah. it in this nice little box. I had to pay an extra 75 cents for another sauce. We got the fish right here, shrimp right here, breaded to perfection. We got some Parmesan fries down there. Oh, that's nice. What's up with. So I'm going to be 100% honest with you. Gordon kind of stingy, bro. He only gave me three shrimps. Uh, I don't care for shrimp. And two fish sticks. Ooh. That's all he gave me. He gave me a little lemon so I can go ahead and squeeze it up on there, bro. I'm going to squeeze it up on there. But... Sixteen dollars, bro, and I only got three shrimps and two fish sticks, bro. It better be crazy. Better be. Yeah. We're going to start out with the fries. So the fries kind of remind me of boardwalk fries. They got a little bit of Parmesan cheese on it, some parsley. That's about it. Let's see what's up with it. We're going to dip into some of this sauce. So I ain't going to lie to y'all. The fries kind of hit in the tartar sauce, but I'm hearing that this curry mango go crazy. Let's see what's up with the curry mango. Does it go crazy? Curry mango good. Okay then. Okay then. That's curry. So I ain't going to lie to y'all. The fries do got a lot of flavor. Seasoned up real good. And that Parmesan do what it do. Definitely we eat these fries again, y'all. Parmesan fries, they're going to get like a 8.5 in the chip. So you fucking with the fries? Okay, okay. Now let's see what's up with the shrimp. Yeah, what's up with the shrimp? They only gave me three pieces of shrimp. And I'm thinking the reason why they did that because these shrimps are probably exquisite, bro. Yeah, they, them and bitches they look fat. Do that with the portions and stuff like that when it go crazy. Let's see what's up. Dip it in some curry mango. Is it exquisite? Oh, he, oh, no, no, no. It's not exquisite, my guy? It's not exquisite? Oh, the breading? The breading is extremely mushy. Like, Ooh. it's not cooked all the way, you see? Breading's kind of mushy. No flavor at all inside of the, the breading. Mm. He didn't put no seasoning in this. He made some batter, went ahead, dipped them in it, and fried them, bro. I'm thinking that's why they come with the sauces, bro, because the sauce is supposed to give you that flavor. But if you just eating these plain, no flavor at all. Damn. Like, point blank, period, bro. Damn. And like, bro, it's Gordon Ramsay. Come on, Gordon Ramsay. I know you know how to season some fucking food, bro. Throw some seasoning in this shit. I want you your spot. I know he's not purpose. Oh, I know he's not. He's not cooking it, but. With the steaks in, in Baltimore, bro. And the steaks was hitting, bro. This shrimp right here, bro, is not hitting. Mm. Now, let's see what's up with the fish. Ooh, that shit broke apart. So, the fish is cod. Ooh. When you're looking at it. It kind of remind you of a, a fillet of fish sandwich. Yeah, that's, that's what the fish look like. You know what I'm saying? Look like that fish sandwich fish. That fish sandwich fish. Let's try with a little bit of tartar. Yeah. Is it good? Ooh, that shit look like it's gonna hit. The fish look like it's gonna hit. The fish hit. Please tell me the fish hit. Please tell me the fish hit. If the fish don't hit, I'm gonna cry. So the batter is extremely saucy. Uh oh. So the batter kind of reminds me of Long John Silver's. And Long John Silver's got a shitty review. Ooh, the fish sticks down here. The I get fish paid sticks over ten thousand dollars a month to do what you are literally doing right now. Watch. Okay, bro. You know what I'm saying? Way too salty. Damn. I don't know what Gordon did with this, bro. But it's it's not what it's supposed to be. I'm honestly disappointed because, like, bro, I was looking forward to this, bro. Like, I'm thinking this is going to be the best fish and chips ever. I, I literally watched another YouTuber review this, and he was like, oh, man, dude. This is the best chips and chips and fish that I've ever had in my life. And I'm like, bro, you was just doing that because you too busy sucking Gordon Ramsay's meat because he's the best, yeah. the best chef in the world, bro. So you're not trying to give your honest opinion, bro. Keep it a band. This shit is disgusting. This shit on the same level as fucking Long John Silver's, bro. Damn. Like, I'm going to give Gordon his props. That joint in Baltimore was hitting, bro. That joint go crazy. But this right here, bro, it's shit. Besides the fries, Damn. the fries go insane. If I ever ever come back here, bro, it's going to be for the fries. But the rest of this shit is ass, bro. 
Honestly, y'all, yeah. these gotta be the most bland shrimp I've ever had, bro. The most bland, bro. This shit is seasoned in parsley. That's the only seasoning I see on this parsley, bro. Damn. It's crazy, bro. Like, the best chef in the world. Like, I get it. Gordon Ramsay's not working in that restaurant. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But he stamped it in. You know what I'm saying? Like, he signed his name off on this restaurant, bro. Like, I gotta hold him accountable. Salty ass fish sticks, bro. I was better off going to go get some of them Gordon's jumps from the fucking TV dinner aisle. Damn. I should have did that. They taste better than this. I'm going to eat it because I spend my hard on cash. But damn, Gordon. This shit. I ain't even about to swallow that shit. Damn. That shit is way too salty. Damn, Gordon, you falling off, Slim. Bro, if you want to be a Gordon Ramsay meat rider and think I'm lying, go ahead and try it out. Gordon Ramsay, I got a better name for you, bro. Name that shit Long John Ramsay's, bro, because it tastes like Damn. Long John Silver's and it's disgusting, bro. Damn. Put some seasoning in your shit. Put a little bit of la 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 la. Damn. Put a little bit of flavor in your shit. I'm stuttering. I'm so mad. Damn. I drove here for this. I'm spitting now. Damn. 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 I can't even get the words out right now, bro. Damn. That's what happens when you got a lisp and you get pissed, bro. Damn. Peaks was acting like Gordon was in there. I'm saying that. I thought to myself, he's still going to eat that mug. And then he keeps it a buck and says, I still going to eat it. Because I spent my hard-earned money on it. I runners he probably never stopped a step foot in that restaurant. Peach too damn entertaining. Tell him like Gordon Ramsay actually cooked this meal. I'm dead. That's funny though. Yeah, it sucks to suck. But subscribe to me. Subscribe to Peaks. Hit both our like buttons and see you guys later. Bye.